So how do you improve your listening skills using NLP? Tip one. Um, so basically, it's important to understand why we're such poor listeners. Every single second, we are bombarded with 11 million bits of information. But we cannot process all that. So we take about 150 pieces that we clump together into five to nine pieces of information. Okay? So that means that when we are engaging with ourselves inside our own head, uh, with our own story, our own narrative, or our own self-talk and all, all those different things, or we're even busy with ex other external information like our phones or the fact that <laughs> there's a beach there or something like that. I even feel the distraction right now even doing this video. I'm, by the way, about a block from a training venue here in Los Angeles. And so one of our amazing training destinations. Uh, other amazing training destinations that we have are Bali and Miami and Amsterdam, Mexico, and we also have a training online taped in Joshua Tree National Park. Anyway, getting back to listening. So when we're engaging too much of the brain with our own internal story, we start, we start failing to, to notice what's going on outside of us. And anyone who's taken an LP training understands how much is actually going on outside of us. First of all, there is a lot in the word choice that we use. Yeah. So there is, you can tell if somebody's visual, auditory, or kinesthetic. Uh, you can tell a lot by the word choice, how well educated someone is, what their, what their programming is, what their belief systems are. You can tell an awful lot about the word choice that someone uses. Um, second of all, you can also tell a lot by muscle tension, facial expressions, things like that. Uh, if you're NLP trained, of course, eye accessing, you can tell a lot by how someone, where someone's eyes move, how they're, they're, how they're using their brain. So there's a lot of information actually out there that you're not paying attention to non-verbally um, if you're stuck inside your own head. So one NLP tip that I can give you to become a better listener is to actually force yourself to actually start paying attention to what's happening outside of you to sort of quiet your inner chatter notice what's going on outside of you to keep refocusing on their story a very simple way of, of doing that is by by saying to yourself i'm not going to tell my own story that would be one solution or i'm going to intentionally only occupy 30 percent of this conversation with my own stuff that would be another way of doing it so um, soon coming, tip number two in how do you improve your listening skills using NLP.